Well, thanks for joining us again. The newly automated probate registry of the Lagos State Judiciary is still generating great relief and commendation from the public. Indeed. Now, the cashless technology is geared to reduce human lapses, improve service delivery, and stop revenue leakages. TBC News' Kemi Faladi Emo returned to the registry days after its commissioning to see how the process now works. The Chief Judge of Lagos State, Justice Okwe Emi Oke, commissioning the new e-filing probate registry at the High Court Iboshiri. It's been called the answer to the many complaints that the old manual system of issuing probate grants and letters of administration in Lagos was cumbersome, unfriendly, and often delayed. The users of the court you know that confidence that they can just walk into the probate, have their matters uh, attended to, without the issue of, oh, the file is not here, oh, we don't know who is going to choose the file, or the file was assigned to my uh, partner and she has gone out on lunch break. The probate registry in Lagos, like other states, houses activities relating to obtaining instruments to facilitate the legal administration and management of estates. It includes events where a person dies, leaving a will or not. A grant of probate will be issued where there is a valid will with an executor acting and a letter of administration given mostly in cases of intestacy. With the e-probate platform, applications can now be submitted through the online portal of probate.lagosjudiciary.gov.ng. Progress is monitored here. Payment is now cashless and will no longer be allowed at the probate registry. Sometimes what should take six months takes about two years, three years to get it out of the A lot of um, um, people have abandoned their estates, uh, their uh, uh, family estates because it takes a long time to procure the administration. But now it's a welcome development. When I came to the probate today and um, seeing the latest development, I'm so pleased. At every stage of your application, you'll be alerted to know what is happening to your application. And then you don't need to come to the registry to know what is happening to your application. By logging into your profile, when you create your username and password, there's a profile there, you can log in. When you log in, then you would know what the status of your application. Solicitors and applicants can now go about their business at the registry with relative ease. But there are calls for an increase to at least 500,000 Naira in the limit of estates worth 100,000 Naira being exempted from undergoing the publication process and payment of 10% probate duty. Practitioners believe this will encourage the processing of more applications at the registry in a speedy and cost-effective manner. Kemi Foladiemo, TVC News, Lagos. You know what they say, technology is the way to go.